Yo, what's up guys? I'm back again with another video. And uh, guys, today we're going to be powering up these two together. The Meguiar's Ultimate Fast Finish versus the Meguiar's Ultimate Quick Wax. Now, I don't know. I ain't never really powered these two together. But uh, I just want to see which one of these is more hydrophobic than the other one. Which one of them delivered the most shine? And we're gonna find out that we already know the McGuire Ultimate Quick Wax is a little bit cheaper and it gives you more ounces in the bottle compared to this stuff. You get almost twice as much. This is an 8 ounce can or 8.5 ounce can here. Well, in the McGuire Ultimate Quick Wax, you get 5.2 ounces. Okay? Alright. Now let's meet your opponent. This is what you're going up against. The Maguire's Ultimate Quick Wax. Hydrophobic Plumbers Technology. Okay, let's back up. This is what I'm going to be doing on uh, my 95 Ford Explorer. Um, I picked this one to do because it's something different. Something for a change of. That's what the body looks like. Yeah. Got my water bottle. I didn't need a racing tape this time because I got the same in the middle. And we, we just, we're going to start off with the McGuire's Ultimate Quick Wax right here. Now let's see what it'll do. And guys, here we go. Okay. Alright, give it a nice shake up. Let it penetrate in there. Okay. That's some really good wax, I must say. That McGuire's Ultimate Quick Wax right there. It's no joke. It's a good wax, guys. Yep, I think it's about nine bucks. Eight or nine bucks, but it's a well spent. Eight or nine bucks. Okay, guys, it's penetrated enough. Now, let's take the microfiber cloth and buff it in. Here we go. Remember, we ain't going past that seam right here in the hood. That's how we're going to separate the two waxes. Okay. Doesn't even need the tape for this, man. It's already got the seam right there separating the two. That's a big hood, though. <laughs> this truck is huge, man. Okay. Rather cold out here, guys. It's like 30 some degrees here. Get that. I caught this one too because it's in the sun. So that would tell me it won't be no moisture on the body. I'm doing this. Okay. Now I'm going to flip the rag. Continue the process. Man. They ain't gonna hurt nothing. So what we're gonna do? I'm gonna hit this one a little bit more. Get a second. To you. That's a little some 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 some. There we go. That's all I'm gonna hit it with. You. Okay. Let that penetrate in. Hit it twice because you know, like I said, it's been sitting here for a minute or two, and you want to kind of you know work the wax in on the hood. So, uh, here we go. All right. It's got pretty good paint on this hood. Also, pretty color, too. It's a good running truck. Just need some little odds and ends, you know. Just don't need it, to be honest, guys. I just don't need it. I got too many to occupy, you know. I got other explorer. I got a black one. I got a white one. I got a burgundy one. I got this one. I got a blue one. So, you know. I 
need more parts. <laughs> then I'm about to buy another one sometime next year. I'm about to get another SUV. Don't know what kind I'm going to get yet, but I'm going to get me another one. Okay, that's white name good enough, guys. All right, let's sit that there. Now, we're going to come over here to the McGuire Ultimate. Look at that shine. What is that shine? Okay. Now, we're going to try the McGuire's Ultimate Fast Finish. Y'all know how to use it. We're just going to shake it up a little bit. And spread the liver to the microfiber cloth. Here we go. This stuff is super quick to use. I'll tell you that much, man. It's really super quick to use. That's for sure. <laughs> All these stuff like this is quick to use, but this is even quicker than fast finish, man. Does an excellent job, also. And see, that's already wiped in and done. Done with. Something good, you know, they don't give you much of it. <laughs> Think about it, guys. Something really, really good. We'll hit that again. Something really, really good. Take notice, they only give you a very little bit of it, right? Not much. Not much. Okay, that's the second coat of this. All right. The job is done. All right, then. That's easy to work with. It's super quick, like I said. And, and uh, can't beat it. Now, let's compare the two shines. This is the McGuire's Ultimate. Quick wax side right here. It's shining like little money. Let's come over here. See the McGuire's ultimate fast finish. Let's get a side angle. I think the quick wax is shining better. Let's see. Let's see. Yep. That could be just my opinion of it, but I believe it is. See that? See them trees? See the quick wax side right there? Now watch come back where the trees hit this side. See the difference? Let's go back. Yup, the McGuire's ultimate quick wax giving a better shine. Alright, now we're getting to what's most important, like I always tell you guys, the water test. We're going to start with the McGuire's Ultimate Quick Wax. Here we go, this side. Don't take that much water, it's a little bit. Okay. Look at that bees. Alright, now we're going to move over here to the McGuire's Ultimate Quick Wax. Oh, shucks. Doesn't take that much water like I always tell you guys. Okay, that's enough water right there. All we looking for is see which one of these two cats be the best. Alright, we're going to start with this side. Now, the water's kind of laying. It's not beating as, as good. Don't seem like to me. It's, gonna, it's doing a great job. But it's not beating as, as much as some waxes I have seen to the Maguire's Ultimate fast finish as you can see it's beating some but it's not a lot check it out check it out good I'm trying to be fair here check it out good all right check it out good see it's kind of laying down that's McGuire's ultimate fast finish okay let's move over here to the McGuire's ultimate quick wax look at those bees look at there Look at there. <laughs> Look at there. Look at there. It bees better. It shines better. 
proof right here, guys. I try to bring y'all realistic videos, man. Look at here. Look at the beating ass, you know, on this stuff. Look at here. It already shined it better. Look at here. Guys, ultimate quick wax. Look how good this stuff beads, man. Look at there. See that? Look at there. Let me show you the small little beads. Look at there. Come back off it. Look at there. Now, let's jump across the, the line. Back over here to the ultimate fast finish. Look at here. See how it's laying down on the car? Man, when I see something that ain't beating as good, as you can see here, that's telling me it's not as um, hydrophobic as the other one. And you see the beating action going on with the quick wax. Look at there. Look at all the little balls, man. Right there. Compared to this, the fast finish side. So the winner here, you can see it's flattening it out on the car. It's not even beating a lot. See that? Look at there. It's not doing anything much. So the winner here is the McGuire's Ultimate Quick Wax. It's cheaper. You get more per ounces. You get 15.2 ounces in the McGuire Ultimate Quick Wax. Versus the McGuire's Ultimate Fast Finish, you only get 8 ounces. Okay? So uh, that's running you about $13 to Fast Finish. And the McGuire's Ultimate Quick Wax will run you about 9 or 10 so you get more product and save money also. So you see how hard your forward that is. Look at there, man. The quick wax side. Look at here. Boy, is that hard your forward or what? All right. Now look at the fast finish. One more last look. See how it's rolling, flattening out on the car? See that? It's not even beating like this uh, quick wax here. Well, guys, the results you have, you see it, you see it raw, live and direct right here. And can't get no better results nowhere. It's live and direct on a good paint job at it. Good enough, anyway, I say. All right. So, uh, guys, there you have it. I'll tell you which way to go right here. Which one to, be, to buy, to pick up. All right, guys, take care, man. Get them rides lit. And I'll see you guys on the next video, man. Peace out.